Canon Air Intake System is designed to increase power and acceleration by reducing restriction in the intake path. Canon 69-1020TS Air Intake fits 2012 and 2013 Honda Civic with a 1.8 liter engine. The 69-1020TS Air Intake is not legal for highway use in California or other states adopting California emission standards. Check knfilters.com for an up-to-date list of models this air intake fits and for a list of other carb adoption states. Canon power testing showed an estimated power gain of 3.1 horsepower at 5,424 RPM with the 69-1020TS air intake installed on a 2012 Honda Civic with a 1.8 liter engine. Actual results will vary depending on the condition of the vehicle, mileage, weather, and other variables. With the air intake installed, we ran the vehicle on the dyno to test the sound comparison versus the stock intake. The intake system includes components that have been designed or matched to the needs of these vehicles to produce a safe horsepower increase. Detailed installation instructions are included with this kit. The tools needed for this install are shown. Turn off the ignition and disconnect the negative battery cable. Loosen the hose clamp securing the intake tube to the air box and then disconnect the tube from the air box. Disconnect and remove the fresh air hose from the air box and fresh air inlet. Then remove the hose from the vehicle. Remove the two bolts retaining the air box. Lift up the air box to release it from the mounting grommet and then pull it forward to gain access to the mass air sensor connection. Disconnect the mass air sensor electrical connection and then remove the complete air box assembly. Release the spring clamp securing the crankcase vent hose connections to the valve cover and intake hose. And then disconnect the crankcase vent hose connections. Release the spring clamp securing the coolant bypass hose connections to the engine. And then disconnect the coolant bypass hose and remove the bypass hose crankcase vent pipe assembly. Install the provided coolant bypass hose and secure with the provided hose clamp. Loosen the hose clamp securing the intake hose to the throttle body and remove the intake hose from the throttle body. Install the provided silicone hose onto the throttle body and secure with the provided hose clamp. Install the provided silicone hose onto the fresh air duct and secure with the provided hose clamp. Install the two rubber mounted studs onto the provided bracket and secure with the provided hardware. Install the bracket assembly onto the front airbox mount. Remove the mounting grommet from the airbox. Install the mounting grommet into the heat shield. Install the provided edge trim onto the heat shield. Install the heat shield assembly onto the airbox mounting stud and rubber mounted studs and then secure with the provided hardware. Secure the fresh air inlet hose to the heat shield with the provided hardware. Remove the two screws securing the mass air sensor and then remove the mass air sensor from the factory air box. Install the mass air sensor into the can and intake tube and secure with the provided hardware. Apply several drops of the provided glue to the air insert. Install the mass air sensor insert into the can and intake tube. Install the provided vent fitting into the can and tube. Install the provided silicone hose onto the intake tube and secure with the provided hose clamp. Install the intake tube into the silicone hose at the throttle body. Do not tighten the hose clamp at this time. Install the filter adapter onto the mounting bracket using the provided hardware. Install the filter adapter into the silicone hose on the intake tube and align the bracket with the mounting holes in the heat shield. Secure the bracket with the provided hardware and secure the tube with the hose clamps. Reconnect the mass air sensor electrical connection. Install the provided crankcase vent hose onto the vent port of the valve cover and to the fitting installed into the k intake tube. Install the k air filter and secure with the provided hose clamp. Reconnect the vehicle's negative battery cable. 
double check to make sure everything is tight and properly positioned before starting the vehicle. It will be necessary for all K&N high flow air intake systems to be checked periodically for realignment, clearance and tightening of all connections. Failure to follow the above instructions or proper maintenance may void warranty. K&N makes products for nearly every vehicle on the road. The K&N website allows you to search products by vehicle or dimension, download installation instructions, view dyno chart showing estimated horsepower gains for this product, and view product details. For more information on where to buy K&N products, go to knfilters.com.